Hi everyone. Today we present you with our weekly technical insights on how to create Buzz Bay. Before that, I would like to give brief introduction about Capricot Technology Private Limited. For more than three decades, Capricot has played a significant pivotal role in country's computer aided de design adaptation. And today we are con concentrating on information modeling to address the start to finish design and construction difficulties faced by the building and infrastructure industries. We deliver the finest solution methods and procedures to enhance your productivity and reduce your project risk. Our team of more than 250 plus designers based in all major cities have constantly provided outstanding value, adaptation, support and services to optimize the true potential of more than 20,000 plus customers wholeheartedly ranging from national importance project to complex building. We are delighted to inform you that we have a global footprint to serve you with based of our abilities. Capricot technology is now a part of Arkans group. In these insights, we see how to create a bus bay in civil 3D. Basically, the objective of bus bay creation is to design safe and efficient areas along the roadways where buses are stopped for passengers boarding and alighting. This enhances safety, improves traffic flows, ensures accessibility and complies with regulations. Bus bay are seamlessly integrated into the overall road design, optimizing bus operations within the transportation infrastructure projects. Let's see in uh, software to how to create a bus bay along the alignment. Here you can see I have already created a one alignment with both side offset at a distance of 3.5 meter and uh, also created assembly. So that required for creation of corridor. Now if I want to create a bus bay in between 2.4 kilometer to 2.8 kilometer. So I just simply select the polyline. And select the start start station. And with some tapering, I have draw a polyline. I'm just draw a polyline along the alignment with no specific uh, dimension that is a tapering ratio all that. Now I'm going to create corridor. Just give a name to corridor. I'm just take as corridor one and corridor style is Indian basic. Uh, and here you can see the three options of uh, alignment. So uh, always select the center line alignment and our design profile is uh, profile type is de uh, design profile and assembly is two lane highway and uh, also specify the target surface which is uh, existing surface and uh, set as OK. And uh, here from uh, target option, you can set the target. I'm just set the target for left side is left side offset alignment and for right side uh, here please make sure uh, you select the uh, polyline to make the uh, uh, bus bay in the uh, uh, along the alignment and hit ok apply and rebuild the corridor let's take some time create a corridor and enter it OK. And here you can see the bus space created in between 2.4 kilometer to 2.8 kilometer. I'm just showing you in a 3D view.
yeah here is conceptual model is created of a corridor and yes our first page created i hope you guys had a, had an insightful session do subscribe to our youtube channel for all updates do reach out to us for any suggestion query or topic you would want to discuss see you next week thanks and take care